Yeah, I'm the younger brother of Kubana chief priest, Pascal Okechuku. And my name is Bethel Okechuku, popularly known as Trita. My brother is a very generous person. He has helped a lot of people. I know he's busy right now, and I pray that one day he will remember me also. For now, I'm a phone repairer in Alaba International Market, Lagos. One that's child never end, guys. Imagine being a billionaire, being in the eyes of the public, and then there's your brother behind the scene who is begging money, who is a phone repairer on the street of Alaba, guys. Make it make sense. Kubera Chief Priest, younger brother, coming out on social media to tell the whole world that Kubera Chief Priest is not giving him a lending hand. Chief Priest is a very wealthy man. He opened a cow farm for Obi Kubana. So imagine doing all that just for sure, and then your brother, your own junior brother, is living in abject poverty. There is no way to judge it, but then again we are only looking at it from one angle which is the brother's point of view what about we look at it from a chief priest point of view what if chief priest have tried his possible best to help his brother but the brother is always delivering bare minimum what then do you think kubana chief priest should do imagine giving your brother 100 uh, 1 million 10 million take this money you are my junior brother go start a business and then two years down the line he comes back and he's like hey brother the money don't finish you you if you are a person bringing out the money you will get hurt because you suffered you labored for that money but you are just giving it to your younger brother it's an investment on your younger brother and then he comes back 10 million is gone you as a younger brother you want to see your brother doing well you say okay you know what come follow me learn these skills this is what i do this is what made me rich. learn from me and then do what i do and then he'll be like oh my name my name my name my name oh, boy, you know if he may come me with my own plan he has his own plan and then you'll be like okay let me support you again another 10 million two years 10 million down the drain how will you as a brother feel i'm talking to you guys the person watching the video how will you feel now giving your brother 20 million and he squandered it under four years will you still have the heart to give him another money to start up a business or will you be like okay since you have your own plan go do your thing let me just sit back and relax all i have to say again is if indeed chief priest is doing all these great uh philanthropist work for the people of nigeria but his own blood his own younger brother is living in abject poverty he should shake his life and uh reevaluate himself as a brother as a senior brother as a father and as a man but if indeed his brother has squandered numerous opportunities why would you come out on social media to try and stain your brother's wife why i'm believing you with this piece of advice do not judge any story by hearing one side always make sure that you get both sides of the story before you make your judgment at the end of the day celebrities that we see or social media influencers that we see on social media we only see 10 seconds 20 seconds five minutes of their life we don't know what is going on when the camera is turned off so if you are going to judge somebody with 10 with a 10 seconds clip that you see of them ask yourself a question if my life is in public as their life is how will people judge me think about that as you give this video a like subscribe if you enjoyed this video and then turn on your post notifications so you'll be reminded anytime i drop a new video i'll see you guys on the next one have a nice day bye bye